Paramount is the largest privately owned aerospace and defense business on the African continent, uh, probably the largest in the Southern Hemisphere. Um, it's a global business, uh, proudly African, but operating in more than 30 countries around the world. Um, we have partnerships with governments in um, Southeast Asia, in the Middle East, in Eastern Europe, in Central Asia, South America, in Europe. So we're a, a truly global organization and we're proof that you can take African homegrown technology and you can not only export it around the world, but you can become the best in the world at what you do. We're very privileged to have a tremendous skills base in Africa. Most people don't believe that South Africa or that Africa is a source of high-tech engineering skill and we have some of the most tremendous engineers, innovators, scientists, developers in the world um, in, 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 in Africa and we use those people to develop product which is today not only leading in its field in, in, in the world but also cutting edge. It's the kind of technologies that nobody else in the world is developing. Our expansion strategy has to do with partnerships. We know that we cannot grow um, organically without partnering with governments around the world. The defense industry is an industry where um, private sector can only engage with government or other defense companies in the world. So we know that our, part, our, our expansion, our growth, our globalization is going to come through these partnerships. So we have multiple partnerships with governments around the world and we're constantly adding to those. CSR is absolutely in our DNA. Paramount's about creating skills, creating jobs, but also creating capacity in the environments, in the, in the um, communities in, in which we operate. And we have many, many programs around the organization that do this. Um, we've been very successful in many of them. We also are actively involved in anti-poaching activities. We do a lot to protect our environment. We also believe that um, apart from the skills and the, 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 the human capital that Africa has, our wildlife is part of our heritage. It's part of what makes us African. So CSR for us is absolutely fundamental. History has proven that the most effective projects in the African environment have been private sector led. Governments need to create enabling environments. Governments need to create platforms for the private sector to go and do what they do. And whether it's commercial activities, infrastructure development or CSR projects, the most successful projects are private sector led and driven. And if you look at African economies, the economies that tend to work best are the economies that have the least government intervention. And I'm not suggesting that there shouldn't be regulation, there must be. But governments should regulate, they should facilitate, and they should encourage private sector to go on and do what they do best. The legacy that we want to leave is we want to show Africans that if they believe in themselves, if they project their capability internationally, we truly are a continent that right now is able to take our place in the global economy. We're no longer a charity case. We can make a difference, and there are many, many young Africans that will make a difference into the future.